What's up, Epic Gamers? You know what time it is. You've seen the intro. It's Halo Toy News time. And today, we've got something that I didn't actually expect. U2's X-Halo. So they released this preview image a few days prior and some people were able to enhance it and see what was uh, behind the veil. Now I was a little bit um, confused at first. I thought this homeboy in the middle was Atriox. I definitely did. Uh, the actual result is surprising to me. But hey, I mean like I'm, I'm all for this. Like I'm all for a U2's collaboration. Halo's had a decent relationship with Pop Vinyl in the past. Uh, they hadn't had any Pop Vinyls for a long time. They had like Halo 3 and some 4, but then they went dormant for a while and they came back for Infinite. Um, but now we're seeing a new player in the field and U2's has produced this. Five new Halo action figures. They retail for $30 each. They look super premium. They're currently for pre-order on the U2's website. They look good. I don't know. What, I don't know what to tell you. They look really fun. I would love to add some of these to my collection. Just something I was not expecting, and something that is clearly like you can see a lot of toy companies recently paying real homage to uh, Halo 3. We got that with the new. Um, Mini mates, no little people with Halo 3, and we've seen some others. This is uh, no exception. This is Halo X U2s. We've got the Master Chief Cortana, Recon, and then a chase variant of a Recon. I believe it's one in every six will be the chase variant with the flaming head. And uh, yeah, the Flood tank, which does seem surprising to me. So here we go. This is our lineup. I like that U2's on their website reveals like these really nice sort of 3D renders. I do appreciate that. We got the recon absolutely kitted out with a shotgun and sniper. They look really good. Obviously like 3D renders are very different from the final product as we've found with a lot of toy companies. But we're gonna start with the Chief. Um, just nice, you know, it's the classic Halo 3 with a little bit of battle damage on the chest. No 117, but uh, good clean colors. Uh, I'm liking it. It looks it looks good. It looks good. The classic assault rifle, black and gray. Um, yeah, these are all going to be apparently U2s are like online exclusives a lot, and they are like limited drops, a one and done, and then they're gone forever. You can see on their website they launch in four days, which is pretty soon, and that's actually crazy because the new Jazzware Vault drop is in five days, so everything's happening all at once. But yeah, we got the Master Chief Cortana. Super chibi, that is very cute. We got the Recon with a lovely shotgun there. I think this is my favorite. It's probably gonna be a lot of people's favorite. Let me know in the comments which you would wanna pick if you could only have one. And there's our Flood Tank. Yeah, such a strange choice, but I'm for it. I love it. All right, the Master Chief, so pre-order. Yeah, Master Chief is locked, loaded, and ready for his U2's debut. 4.8 inches, gripping a UNSC standard assault rifle, prepared for any Covenant, sorry enough to get in his way. Very nice, very fun. And we got Cortana. U2s has downloaded Cortana straight into our system with their absolutely glowing debut. Fun. The Spartan Recon, yeah. So um, does it say, yeah, one in six chance of unlocking the Mjolnir skin armor, which sees bright flames erupting from their helmet. Very cool. And the Flood, just called the Flood, a monument to all your sins. And this is what we're all about, boys and girls, a grunt plushy and it's only 30 bucks as well I thought this would be way more expensive it's not it's 30 bucks the same as all the figures a grunt plushy with a one in six chance to activate the grunt birthday party where's my grunt birthday party where is it where is it there it is look at it the grunt birthday party oh my god I've never I've never wanted something more in my life <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. I gotta buy as many grunts as possible until I get that plushie. I mean, th that's so badass. Then we got a Halo pin set as well, 30 bucks. Um, the Arbiter's brown instead of gold. A few people pointed that out, a bit strange. Also, they're sort of teasing Johnson there. I think Johnson might be a season two of these if they sell well, um, because they clearly have like got the render. They, that's what they're figuring out there. Um, so that's fun. We got the Master Chief Cortana. They look way cleaner in these like stylized images. Um, and Master Chief, with, with obviously there's way more lines uh, than you'll get on the actual figure. That recon though, I think that if I think if I was to get one, I would get the recon to be honest. Um, U2's Master Chief number zero. Oh goodness, number one with Cortana, number two with the recon, and my baby. Oh my baby boy, little Billy the Grunt. 
Uh, so that is the third official Billy the Grunt that we've got. Um, the first one was a PAX exclusive or Halo Fest, and the second one was a dog toy that I think you could still get on Amazon. Search Halo Grunt dog toy. And there's the birthday pie, one in six. It's absolutely gorgeous. I desperately need these both on my shelf. Please, you twos, please. There's our pin badge set, really nice. These don't pop out as much to me, but like I'm not a pin guy. I know a lot of people are way more fans of pins than I am, so I can't really pass the judgment. But let me know what you think of all this. I mean, you twos, Halo, they seem like a match made in heaven. Like, I I'm excited for these. I would love to have all four of these on my shelf. The grunt plushie is where it's at. They always say to leave no prisoners, but just look at this little guy. Halo X U2s coming in four days to the U2s store. The grunt is chef's kiss. It looks absolutely beautiful. Let me know what you think down below. Thank you very much for tuning in. As always, stay awesome, stay safe. Domain out.